Hi, this is Peter Dines at reactortips.com, and today we're going to look at how to add samples to the sample map in Loop 2, my sample slicer and manipulator for Native Instruments Reactor. It's actually quite simple. We'll click here to make sure that Reactor is in edit mode, then click here to reveal the uh, sample map editor window. Now I'll switch to a uh, file browser grab some files. Oops, one thing, very important, in the drop down over here with the gear wheel, always make sure that move root with low note is selected. And in this other drop down, make sure that loop cloud is selected so that we're adding our samples to the correct sample map. So we select them all, drag them over here, and you'll notice depending upon your vertical mouse position, uh, that will determine how many keys uh, are assigned to each sample. You want to drag near the bottom so that it's uh, one sample per key. And we'll release. And there are the samples. And because we had it set to move root with low note, the uh, root always corresponds to the MIDI key that the sample is placed on. So counting up from 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, etc., which is going to correspond to uh, the number in, that's displayed on the uh, sample select knob, which lets you choose which sample you're working with in a particular snapshot and manipulate it. Thanks for watching today, and I hope you have a lot of fun with Loop 2.